Rebecca's got like Sundays and Mondays, four hours of television locked down. Oh, I love that. Locked down. On this week's Celebrity Challenge, Jerry O'Connell and Rebecca Romaine. What, Jerry, what was Rebecca's Friends episode called? When it was called, it? it was called The Dirty Girl. Yes, the one with the dirty girl. The yes, that is so impressive. Yeah. Yeah. Um, what was Jerry's full character name in Stand By Me? Vern Tessio. Yeah, that's yes. right. But is there a middle name that came now? Yeah. Vertesio. I know you guys are big reality TV fans, but what is Rebecca's reality TV guilty pleasure that every time oh. it comes on? Go ahead. It's a, it might be a dead heat between 90 Day Fiance and Maps, Married at First Sight. But I'm going to say 90 Day Fiance. I really love it. Yeah. Do you all have a of favorite? them. Every single one. All By the way, Rebecca's such a all fan. All of the incarnations. The single way, life. Rebecca's such a fan. So what it's, happens now? What so, happened before? So before Sundays, the 90 days, Sundays is 90, 90 days day, now. Sundays is 90 Day Fiance the other way. I think it the is. The other way. Right? And then Mondays is 90 Day Fiance the single, the single life. life. But then Rebecca and I immediately watch the pillow talk afterwards, which is popular couples. Commenting from the, from the cast. Commenting on the episode we just watched. So Rebecca's got like Sundays and Mondays, four hours of television locked down. Oh, I love locked it. Locked down. I love I like it. What, when I watch Pillow Talk, I feel like I'm chatting about those episodes with my with my friends. No, we have so much fun watching them. We do I invitations. It. I mean, uh, it's crazy. I'm sorry, I don't mean to offend, but Andre is like someone is snitching. they snitch. <laughs> snitching on him. He's so about to get green card. And someone is snitching, Snitch. and I believe it's from the family. It might be the brother. That I mean, that's terrible. no, it isn't. It's pretty good. I want to apologize to Andre <laughs> and everyone from Moldova. Apologies. I don't even know what I'm a fan. I love you, Andre. I can't believe that people are snitching on you. I would never do such a thing. But I do want to say to Andre, he's worried about a family member. It could have been a viewer. Yeah. It could have been anybody. Like, okay. sorry, that's another show. <laughs> I love it. Um, then a last one. I know you mentioned it before about how you met, but what was Jerry's pickup line when you first met? Do you remember? Oh. Yeah. It was, uh... Actually, no, I didn't have a pickup line. It was Rebecca's friend who said, take her phone number. It was actually Rebecca's friend. So getting good with the friends, everybody. Mm-hmm. That's the friends voice. help you out. I don't know if there was a pickup line. Um, yeah. There was a section of the... Oh, I think I was like, oh, was your father a thief? Because he stole the stars out of the sky and put them in your eye. No, he didn't say that. He um, didn't say that, that's for sure. <laughs> um, was your daddy on drugs? What? Because he was high what? the night he dreamed of you. That's is that a compliment? <laughs> Father, a drug addict? No. Oh, no. Someone must have been high the night they came up that doesn't sound like my dad. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry, Rebecca, thank you both so much. It's uh, always a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you so much. Sorry, Andre. Sorry, Andre. <laughs>